Hello and welcome to another edition of Electronic 80s. My name's Ian McClucky. Theme of the week, questions. Follow you around everywhere in town Do 
First of all, we had Howard Jones and What's Love Got To Do With It from... No, not What's Love Got To Do, but What Is Love from 1984. Um, and that reached number four. Following that, we had Soft Cell from 1982 and What from Non-Stop Erotic Cabaret. Let's carry on with the same theme. Tina Turner from 1984. What's Love Got To Do With It? This is definitely What's Love Got To Do With It. <laughs> Touch of your hand makes my folks react That it's only the thrill of boy meeting girl opposites a track It's physical Only logical You must try to ignore that it means more than Turner and what's love got to do with it? Let's go to 1984 now, I think. And Adam and the Ant, friend or foe. Oh, my enemy. Oh, I hate those who get to know me. Oh, to become a 
is all my enemies Take it up and leave it I'm not gonna change a bit If it means heartache Then leave it up for your sake I tried and I tried, tried To take out my insides Nobody's perfect So leave me if you object Wow, wow, wow All those things you get to know me album of Adamant um, it was called Friend or Foe the album and it was that was Friend or Foe also had Goody Two Shoes on it too let's stay in 1982 and Carly Simon
from the soundtrack of a film, Soup for One, which predominantly had chic chat tracks on it. Um, and that was Carly Simon and why it reached number 10. 1982 is getting a good run out today. It must have been the year that everybody wanted to ask questions. This one's number, this one got to number one. Give me time.
from 1986, Luther Vandross and Give Me The Reason. Only reached number 26 in the UK, came from the Give Me The Reason album. And before that, of course, it was Culture Club from 1982 and the Kissing To Be Clever album. And that, of course, reached number one. Let's go to 1984 now and uh, a young Nick Kershaw. Wouldn't it be good? <laughs> Wouldn't it be good? Reach number four. In 1984. That wouldn't it be good from the Human Racing album. Let's go for the Christmas number one now of 1981. 
Don't you want me? Cocktail bar. When I met you, I picked you out. 
from 1987. Pros, Matt and Luke Goss, and of course Craig Logan was still there at the time. And When Will I Be Famous from the album Push. It got to number two. And of course before that we had Don't You Want Me by the Human League. Let's go to 1984 again. And uh, Pronsky Beat, they're asking the same question as Carly Simon was earlier. Why? Tell me why! distinctive voice of Jimmy Somerville there and Why from 1984 Age of Consent album and it reached number 4 I'm going to go back to 1980 now you probably won't know this well you might know the song if you've ever watched Shrek 3 because it does feature in it The Ramones Do You Remember Rock and Roll Radio The All-American Half this is Rock and Roll Radio. Come on, let's rock and roll with the remote.
is Rock and Roll Radio. Stay tuned for more rock and roll. Debut single from the fine young cannibals, Johnny, Won't You Come On Home, from 1985. Got to number 38. Um, no, it didn't. Got to number 8. Sorry, I'm going to change the track after this. I'm going to play. This is from 1988. And uh, Deacon Blue, When Will You Make My Telephone Ring?
A minor hit for Deacon Blue from the Rain Town album in 1988. Got to number 38. And um, when will you make my telephone ring? Still a favourite at the um, when you see them live though they always play it. Uh, and that's me done for the day again. Gosh, doesn't time fly sometimes? And I'm going to leave you with that very question: Where does the time go? So until the next time, I see McClock is saying bye bye, and I'll leave you with Julia Fordham from 1988. And where does the time go? Bye-bye. If I could have a pound for every moment I've spent worry Another little thing to like that Frankly, there's no worry And I will be a rich girl And I want to be a rich girl Soon I'm going to this way